Today's workplaces are full of distractions for employees. How can a leader be a, an effective communicator in that environment? Well, it's a wonderful question. There really is too much information now, I think, to be, to be effective. I think it is inefficient. It's getting to the point where it's inefficient. Uh, my best clients uh, no longer carry Blackberries. I won't tell you their names because, uh, uh, obviously, uh, <laughs> they probably wouldn't like it. But, but there, is a, there seems to be a direct correlation between the amount of busyness that one takes onto their life and the amount of effectiveness they'll have as a leader. Uh, like most things, there are only a very few things that make a difference. You know, it's, there's, a, there's a trim tab factor in, in leadership, and it is that you know, the trim tab is that very, very small piece of metal on a very, very large ship, which only the captain can adjust. Uh, it's actually at the base of the rudder, and you move it a half a degree, and you're going to make or miss your target by thousands of miles. Uh, that's true of leadership, that there are only one or two things that make a difference. Uh, communication is one of them. It is the trim tab factor. Uh, and if you're so busy and think that your value is in the number of email messages that you get or give or the number of charts that you read or the number of Excel spreadsheets or PowerPoint slides that you can operate with within a day, then you're sadly mistaken. Um, so understanding uh, the import of your question is one of the most important things a leader can do. That a lot of the information is noise and we have to be able to ferret out the noise from what's really important, what's really necessary, and that is for us to connect and to make sure that we're connecting constantly every day as much as we possibly can in a substantive way.